Okay, so uh, this is the BS20 butterfly table system. Yes, it is. Uh, so we're standing in front of a appraiser table and we have a receiver table over there. Okay. Uh, can you uh, give us a walk through about the functions from the different tables? Yes. The possibilities. Uh, so see, uh, this one here is a uh, uh, appraiser table. Yeah. And uh, we also have this. Uh, Squaring, so you can square the element. Mm -hmm. Okay. So if you see this one here, so you have a beam on this side. Uh, and also, if we look at this one here, this is a tool that you can use for clamp. And uh, not, we don't have any clamping hole on this uh, table. So uh, otherwise, we have a hole beam. Place over here, and we'll place down this one in the whole beam. Okay. And uh, you can use that to do uh, gable ends and uh, other non-rectangular forms. Okay. Ah. So the whole beams is like an uh, option for the tables. Yes. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. And, um... and and also we have this uh, tool here, and this is a uh, NT10. This is a, a press that you can pre press plates, similar as the, we saw before. But uh, this one is uh, more manually moved, so you can press plates on the uh, bottom plate or top plate. So, okay. And it runs on pneumatic, as I understand? Yeah, it's a pneumatic powered, but uh, it's hydraulics also in involved. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, what else? Does the table come in different length or is it yeah, like a standard? Yeah, different length uh, from 6 meters and up in steps to 12 meters. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. And also you have, uh, as you see, a top here, we have a material table Yes. that we can drag. Mm -hmm. Should I try it? Yeah, try it. Oh, quite so easy can, to move. Yeah, so you can place the material on this in the far end here, or in that end, and you can drag it with you when you're building the element. Yes. Mm -hmm. Right. And, and also, uh, I forget to mention, when you turn the element, you have pneumatic cylinders here. So, first when you square it up, you clamp it in with pneumatic cylinders. When you will turn it over, you unleash, unleash them, and the element can fall over to the opposite side. Okay, I understand. Uh, and you have pneumatic clamping. Do you have other systems for you clamping? You can also have it in hydraulics. Okay, hydraulics. So, well. All right. Mm -hmm. so depending on uh, how we want to do it. Yes. So. All right. Um, and uh, you have here you have two tables. Can you only buy one table, for example? Or, or is so this is a pair. We call it BS20. But uh, if you want to place a table before that not have an uprising function, you can place it here uh, and do the same thing, but not the uprising. Then uh, you also have uh, pop-up rollers placed here and on that side, so you can lift it up and move the element station okay. to station. Ah, so ba you basically divide the working process in one table on two instead to increase the capacity. Yeah, so you have a uh, easier to get in the material around. So uh, maybe in the first step you make the framing and sheets on this, this station, etc. Okay. Ah, interesting. Mm, looks like a good uh, starting system. Yeah, shall we go over to the end here? Yes. Uh, and also, I forgot to mention that uh, the tables can be included with uh, air connectors, so you can place your power tools uh, ah, okay. Okay. on uh, So on air place. connection directly on the table. I see you have one yeah. uh, connection over there. So you don't have to connect to the walls uh, and drag Cables around ah, the hoses. Yes. Hoses, yeah. Ah, okay. Convenient. Yeah. Okay, and uh, what do we have here? Is yeah, this is the hydraulic turning system. Okay. So yes. this one here 
<laughs> Over here we control the turning process. Ah, okay. Yes. With this here. Mm -hmm. This can be placed in this side or the other side, mm -hmm. or uh, separately placed. But yeah. this is a standardized version standing here. Yeah, but good uh, visible overview of the tables here. Yeah, it's really good to see uh, the turning process, so that's why we place it in this position. Ah, okay. Yes. Uh, right. And also, uh, sometimes they use Tyvek mm -hmm. in the process. So we have okay. this uh, f uh, first step in a, a holder for yes. place rolls of Tyvek or uh, mm -hmm. different type of membranes. Okay. And also, uh, we have a, a, like a cradle. It's a other, other function that you lay the, the roll in it. Ah, okay, so like the more advanced version of yeah, the... Yeah, okay. but this is uh, good for startup. Yeah. yeah. Okay, shall we uh, start the production? Yeah, I think okay. so. Okay, guys, you can start the production.